So a three-point lead for St. Mary's. Howard has it. Over the top of Turner who blocks her shot and takes it away. And time is going to run out on the Dons. Carly Turner wins it at the line and then wins it on the defensive end. And St. Mary's outlasts USF and wins here at home 75-72. to 72. That was a pretty good basketball game. Um, from a Probably from a fan standpoint, from a coach's standpoint, that was a very competitive game. Uh, I think... That is USF and Coach Goodenbauer. I think she instills that competitive spirit in her team. I'd like to think that we do. Uh, so I just thought that was a highly competitive game for Saturday afternoon. And so I think we, today we're like, we have to beat USF. This is a huge rivalry game. You know, they knocked us out in Vegas. So coming back, we knew we had to get it done. And we did. And we just played hard, took the contact. So it was a really good, really gutsy game. Well, I mean, first of all, it's really strange for us because the last two years we've been great at that, you know, finishing out games was our strength. And so I think, I mean, obviously losing Wells was huge and we're just starting to kind of readjust. Um, we've had up and down and we've found ourselves a few times, but to come together at the end of the game was a huge thing for us because we haven't done it this season. Um, and I think it was really important. We really needed it. A dangerous pass, good catch from McKay, missed the layup, got it back and puts it in. Shannon Malden the steal and the basket with the foul. Close games are the best for spectators, coaching staff, people on and off the bench. It's fantastic. Oh, it's the blood gets going. You just you run down the court so much faster. Um, but when it got down to it, and I knew she had to shoot it, and it was quite open, so the block was nice, and just standing there and waiting it out, it was fun. 